Today we review Pirolski's Protein Bib Shorts. Hello legends and super legends, welcome to Vela Harmony. In today's review, we take a look at Pirolski's latest take on their bib shorts. They call it their protein bib shorts. So it's an upgrade from the one that I reviewed in 2018. They send a copy to the channel. And the first thing I want to talk about is what caught my eye was this in the front and around. This vent, vented material. The back, yeah, a lot of the vendors do that. They, they kind of lighten this. But these guys went all the way around. What's it significant about that? You know how it is when you're in the drops? Sweat accumulates here. There's a lot of moisture down here. Not a whole lot of ventilation. So that's nice that they have that. And um, these seams I want to show you that you see here really help how the shorts feel right here. These are the same seams. That curves with the, the anatomic shape of the human leg. I like that touch. Their take on the grippers, they use vertical, vertical silicone lines is about probably three centimeters, about an inch and a half. And then they use a raw cut edge and it really stays in place. You know, I did a four hour ride in these, I got back, but the only thing I noticed was I got a little bit of a tan line under each of the grippers, you know, because it blocks the sun there, but these did not move at all. Uh, you have to work the shorts on when you put them on like any short because these are kind of compressive. They're, um, I wouldn't say they're size small. They're, they're kind of, uh, they're not a club fit. They're anatomically set up so that when you're choosing your size, I'll put the size guide here, you want to pick the closest size to your leg, your hip. That's how I came up with my XL choice. This is what I'm wearing because they make different dimensions in the circumference of the leg of the short for the different sizes. So the XL, even though XL and large have the same length inseam, the width is different. So this width is narrower. When I tried to put this on, I had to spend a lot of time trying to work it on because I did not want to tear the seams. You know, you're supposed to grab, I usually grab all my shorts like this when I'm standing up trying to get this area to mate with my groin because I don't want any chafing. And I usually pull this because when you do that and it, it kind of draws up. That prevents the need to wait for a few minutes when you get on the bike for it to draw up. If you do that ahead of time, you're just ready to go. And that was, that was the same thing with this. And then I noticed these lines just really help the feel of everything. And they have it on the back also. It's just an anatomic styling. Let me flip it on the inside so you can see how it looks. So the stitching is specifically done to keep this thing on you. See how it curves like that? Both of these, same way. That's what you're seeing here and back there. So on the back side, you can see that. And then on the front side, you see that. So you got two curving this way on the front and then curving that way on the back. Once you get this thing on, it just hugs your body. You know, the pad, they just, there's not much. It's just, it's just what you need. I'll put the graphics here that I got off of their sale page on Amazon to where they have different density and different materials for wicking moisture and this is for protecting your skin there are no seams I mean, it feels really good you sit here for the most part i like these that have splits because you don't need anything in the middle that's where your perineum is in the front you have a little bit of air holes for breathability you know pretty standard stuff but the the, the density of the foam i love it this is a kind of i would call this like a, a narrow i wouldn't call this a medium foam i said narrow so people who like thin uh, um, chamois, this is perfect. I love thin chamois. I want to feel my saddle. And when I, was, when I wore this today for the four hour ride I, I used it on, I could feel the saddle. The saddle was, was comfortable, it's there. You didn't feel like there was something between you and the saddle. That's the feel I prefer. So 
they, they, they tick that box for me. Um, let's turn this the other way. The other thing I like was the touch of their logo. It's not loud. They used a cursive just on the back. You can see it there. And then on the leg, they put it on the traffic side for us who, who ride on the right side of the road in cursive, just small. People have to be right up on you to see the brand. They're not gonna see it from across the street. They know something's there. And, the, and this is reflective, both of them. So it's just a nice touch. So what I wanna do now is talk about the straps. They, they were there, they stayed in place. I forgot about them. That means they did their job. They did not fold like some straps do like this and dig into your shoulder. They just stayed flat, very comfortable. The entire short is a comp has a compressive feel once you get it on. It is important that you get your correct size because they're sized anatomically to fit. And if you get something that doesn't fit you, it will either be too loose or too tight. Okay, let me show you what I like about having a properly fitting pair of big tights on the bike. I mean, the assumption is, of course, that you have a good bike fit. No bib shorts will accommodate or make up for a poor fit. When your, when your tights, your bib tights, uh, bib shorts, I keep saying bib tights. As soon as you sit on the bike, when they're settled in, I mean, I pull mine up, as I showed earlier, without grabbing the seams. Once they're settling, sometimes I sit down so they can ride up. But if you don't do that and you get on the bike, a few pedal strokes, they kind of settle into position. When you're riding along with a good fit, a good pair of fitting bib tights, you can feel the contact of the saddle. And due to muscle memory, when you want to go faster, when I want to go faster, I actually unweight the bars and my legs. Like I'm, as I'm talking to you, you see my cadence is going up. I'm not really thinking about it. It's automatic. When I want to go faster, I take all the weight off of my arms. And they go to my legs. And I spin up like that. When you have a good pair of shorts on, when you stand, you sit. It feels the same. Nothing's bunching up. That's what I wanted to show. Put a little small chain ring. So, once you've been riding for a while and your position's dialed in, you don't want to be bothered with shorts that don't fit well. Because if you have loose fabric, they get in the way. If it's loose under here, they cause chafing. They rub you raw. Everything should be against your groin. It should mate your groin. That's, that's what you're looking for. So when you order these kind of shorts or any kind of shorts, make sure you get the correct size. Only size up if you can see the dimensions, as I've shown in the video on their, their uh, size guide. When there's a doubt, yeah, I usually size to the, the next size up because my legs are big and the smaller shorts, they're too tight around here. Okay, but as long as you get that chamois up against your groin with no looseness, you're good to go. So, the cool thing about the pad in these shorts as I pedal, I feel my saddle like there is no pad. Because the saddle also has a cushion. So if you get really thick cushion in your shorts, they almost like dull the, the feeling of, of the... Of the Saddle. I like to feel the saddle because that's what I use as a point, a pressure point to generate force. So when I want to go faster, it just happens. You can see my hands relax. Everything went to my legs. Anyway, I'm getting off track here, but I don't skimp on my kit, whether it's my shorts or tops. I don't want them flapping around. 
because this feels so good, I don't even want to stop peddling. So take the time, get the right stuff, you will benefit from it. You don't have to break the bank of these. $70 price point, you can't beat that. And they, they offer a lot of features that I talked about. So get a copy and let nothing stop you from getting your case.